Hello and welcome back. All right, you've got your starter kit unboxed. Now you're ready to dive in and let's talk about all the practical ways to use these essential oils that come in your kit. You've got something here for every body system. Um, so you've got a powerhouse of support right here at your fingertips. Okay, first thing I wanna point out is this top row has bottles with a white label. Um, this white label is just a sign of Young Living's Vitality line. Vitality means that these oils are labeled for ingestion. Young Living's not allowed to label oils for both topical and internal use, so they created a Vitality line to make it really easy and show us which oils are designed and intended for internal use. One thing I do want to point out is you can buy this 5 milliliter of Vitality Peppermint, but you can also get a 15 milliliter of peppermint with a solid green label. That one's going to be labeled for topical and aromatic use. They're the same exact oil, just labeled differently. So today I want to talk to you guys about how to use your Vitality oil um, with the Vitality intention and then give you a few suggestions if you want to get the oil that's labeled for topical and aromatic use so you can understand the full spectrum of how to use that oil. Okay, first up is peppermint and let's talk about how to use it internally so with the vitality label um, first we love cooking with peppermint it's great in brownies fruit dips lots of your fun summer recipes uh, this is a good one to put in your recipes we also love peppermint for digestive support so add a little bit of carrot oil to a vegetable capsule put a couple drops of peppermint in that take that with a full glass of water it really helps to ease our tummies um, I also will put a drop of this in a glass water bottle or a stainless steel water bottle. You want to stay away from plastic when we are putting oils in our water. Um, but it's great when I'm in the car and get a little motion sickness. I just sip on that peppermint oil. Now when we talk about using the peppermint labeled for topical or aromatic use, great in the diffuser, cupped in your hands and sniffed peppermint. Just one whiff of peppermint helps to open up our sinuses and really helps us breathing better. Um, you can apply this with a carrier oil on your chest before a workout to help invigorate your workout. There's some great research about um, stamina and uh, lung response when people have used peppermint. Um, and applying that topically on your belly if you need some digestive support. Uh, we also will put this on our head or our neck if we have any sort of head and neck tension. Uh, so many good uses for peppermint. You can also put this in a spray bottle with a little bit of water and sea salt, Epsom salt, whatever, and spray around corners maybe that you want those pesky bugs to stay away from in the summer. So many uses. All right, let's talk about lemon. Lemon vitality first up. Lemon is so good for scrubbing your insides, so great for an internal detox. Adding a drop of this to hot water or a wellness tea with some local honey um, and our Thieves blend that we'll talk about in a minute. Um, great, again, in foods, fruit dips, um, lots of good recipes that you can add lemon to. We add lemon to our, our lemon pastas. Um, lemon labeled for topical and aromatic use. We use lemon to clean with so much, you guys. So it cleans your insides and it can clean the surfaces of your home really safely. So for example, I have a uh, play kitchen I got for my daughter on the side of the road covered in crayon, covered in stickers, and we used probably five drops of lemon and a little bit of our Thieves All Purpose spray and cleaned the crayon, the sticker gook, right up. Um, so this, we call this our natural goo gone, uh, sticky surfaces, Sharpie on the wall, anything like that, and you're good to go. Um, this can also be great for dark spots on your skin. Um, one thing I would recommend is if you're going to use lemon on your skin to be sure that you are staying out of the sun. So if you want to use lemon on your body, we want to apply it to an area that's going to be covered if you're going to be exposed to the sun um, anytime soon. Okay, so just know that when you're using lemon. All right, let's see what's next. Thieves is next. Thieves Vitality. Um, so using it in the Vitality way, Thieves is a powerhouse for our immune system, you guys. It's got cloves, cinnamon bark, lots of great oils that are so, so good for fighting the ickies. We like to use this one preventatively. Um, when we're talking about Vitality, again, you can add this to a capsule. You can add this to a wellness tea. Um, you can put a drop under your tongue. This one is spicy, so know that you've got the spice of the cinnamon uh, that can really be a warming sensation if you're not used to it, okay? So feel free to dilute this one. Follow the instructions on the label for safe dilution. 
Um, but we like to use this one preventatively, so I take a drop of this in our Ningxia Red every single day if you were doing a daily wellness tea. So it'd be a good one to add to your daily wellness routine to really help keep the ickies away. Now, um, to amp it up, we use this also, we use the topical and aromatic version in our diffuser so that everyone is getting great immune support or before people come over, maybe we have kids coming over to play or uh, friends coming over for dinner. We like to put thieves in the diffuser um, just as people are bringing extra germs into our house. We also make up a wellness roller of thieves and oregano um, in a 10 milliliter roller bottle and everyone gets that rolled on their spine or on their feet every single day to help prevent the ickies. You can um, up that if you are dealing with a support issue. Maybe you want to use it every few hours. Oils metabolize in our body every few hours, so if you're dealing with an issue, we like to apply that often. Okay, we're going to learn that Thieves is also so, so good for cleaning. So, Young Living has an entire Thieves cleaning line. Uh, you can also choose to make some of your own DIY recipes. We encourage you to look that up and use your Thieves oil for some of those cleaning DIY recipes. All right, next up is Citrus Fresh Vitality. Uh, again, great for your water, great for your recipes. Citrus Fresh contains tons of citrus oils. Uh, the citrus oils are high in D-limonene. Google that, you guys. D-limonene is so, so good for your body uh, in many ways. So this one's good. Get it in and on your body. Um, the aromatic version of this, we love this in the diffuser to freshen your house. We love this on our wool dryer balls to help our laundry smell great without all the toxic chemicals. Great mood booster in our citrus oils. So if you need a, maybe a fresh start to your morning, people wake up grumpy, pop some citrus oils in your diffuser. All right, next up is... Digize. Digize Vitality. Digize is so good for your digestive system. You guys, a balancer in both directions. We've had support for this um, in both constipation and in diarrhea and food poisoning. We have used this for all the things. We do not travel without Digize. You guys, often when you're traveling, you are um, eating foods that maybe you're not used to or maybe you're not eating things that are good for you. So always keep Digize in your travel bag. Uh, Digest Vitality, you can add this to tea, you can put a drop underneath your tongue, you can, again, my favorite way is to put it in a capsule. I don't love the taste of this one, it's really um, strong, it's got fennel, ginger, anise, all those great powerhouse digestive oils, uh, but if you don't love the taste of this one, add this one to a capsule, down the hatch, and you're good to go. A topical version of this can be diluted and applied to your belly or the center portion of your foot. Um, look up the Vitality, or Vitaflex charts. Uh, Google Vitaflex charts or find those in your reference books and you'll find some great uh, pressure points and um, target Vita Vitaflex points on your body to uh, really ap maximize application. Okay, so those are some good things to look into. Digest is so, so good for your belly um, and you can dilute this for children. We love that one. All right, next up is Raven. You'll notice that Raven and Panaway both have this childproof cap and that's just because it has an oil called wintergreen in it that is not recommended for children under the age of six. So um, we choose to use it a little bit before uh, just because of the experience that we've had and the success that we've had and um, my oldest responds okay to that. So uh, do your research and make your own decision there but know that that's why that cap is here. Raven is a blend of respiratory supporting oils. It's got eucalyptus, it's got camphor in it. So think about your chest rubs that you might buy at the store has an ingredient called camphor in it and that is synthetically derived okay so that's man-made in a lab um, and we want to avoid all that this has camphor from a plant from a plant yes so that's a no-brainer for us we love to make a chest rub with raven uh, coconut oil raven apply that on your chest apply that on your back it's also great in the diffuser for a soothing night's sleep if you're having any tort sorts of uh, congestion, respiratory issues. So, so good, you guys. Um, next is lavender. Lavender is our Swiss army knife of oils. You have maybe had an experience with lavender because it's so good for all the things, cuts, burns, scrapes. Um, and we also have great success using this to support our bodies as the season change. So when our allergies flare up, when things start blooming and we start sniffling and sneezing, lavender is our go-to. We actually use a blend of lemon, lavender, and peppermint in a roller. Apply that over our sinuses, uh, behind the ears, a couple times a day, and you guys will be amazed by the results. 
we've had success and we hope you will too using lavender in that way. We also like to use the Vitality version of lavender in the summer to make a, a lavender um, lemonade. Um, it's great to infuse in different things. Um, I'd love to hear the ways you like to use lavender. Great on those burns. Such a good skin supporting oils, especially for our little people. Oh, and I almost forgot. The most um, way that we use this oil the most is for good sleep. So I put a drop of this on my pillow in my hands, rubbed over my face every single night. Our little people get this in the diffuser um, and on their feet. So definitely pull out your lavender for good sleep. Next up is Pan Away. Let's work this one out of the container. And Pan Away is a blend of oils like wintergreen, helichrysum, oils that are great for pain management. So think achy, sore muscles, um, good for the elderly who maybe have sore muscles all the time, good for athletes who maybe have had a hard workout, great for kids who are maybe suffering from growing pains. We like to make a little rub, a balm, so that we have this one at the ready and we can apply when we need it. Another great way to use your pan away is in an Epsom salt bath. We like to get a cup of Epsom salts, four to five drops of pan away added to the Epsom salts first, then sprinkled in your bath. You never want to add oils to your bath water um, because the oils and water won't mix. So they're just going to sit on top of the bath water and irritate your skin. So always add your oils to Epsom salts first. First. Um, but that's a great way to soothe those sore, tired muscles at the end of the day. Next up is frankincense. You guys, I love frankincense. And I love that it comes in the kit because it's such a precious oil. Um, frankincense, Google this one, you guys, pubmed.gov. So much good research happening on uh, frankincense and its ability to support brain, eye health. Also great for the immune system. Uh, we use this one a lot for good skin care. So I would recommend getting this oil out adding it, putting it by your daily moisturizer and adding a drop to your moisturizer and getting it on your face every single day. Um, I also love, love, love this oil for emotional support. It was my personal oil of choice at the end of my pregnancy. Putting it in my hands, huffing it, it was such a grounding, calming oil. People like to use this a lot during their quiet time. Maybe if you are reading scripture or um, doing yoga, it's a great one just to calm and relax the mind. This one's also super gentle, so we love this for little people. Um, it's my actual, a combination of lemon and frankincense is my choice for little people under two for respiratory support, so congestions. Um, any sort of that kind of thing layered on the chest. So you guys will use a lot of frankincense. We actually work to get this one on everyone in our family every single day because it's so good for us. Young Living did a great job of giving us oils in our starter kit to support healthy emotions. Um, emotion support is not something that I really knew much about when I first got my oils, but you guys, it has been a game changer for me, especially if I've, I've, I've had a couple of babies and use these uh, postpartum. Um, but three oils are going to be great for your emotions. Valor is my all-time favorite oil, and I love to apply this blend on my wrists, on my neck. It's called our bravery oil. Great for um, those situations where maybe you are the newbie in the room, or maybe you're doing something a little out of your comfort zone. Uh, we also love to use this on our oldest daughter for when she's um, having new experiences or maybe having some of those really big feelings. You'll notice a beautiful blue color in this oil um, and that comes from the lovely blue tansy. Um, so I think that just makes it even more special. Um, Peace and Calming is a great oil to diffuse um, at night. We love this one during our bedtime routine just to make the home I and mean, our bedtime experience a lot more calm. I also love this one on my feet, on my big toe to help calm my brain down at night. Um, and then great for little people. This is actually my go-to on babies under two for chest and back. Um, to help when we have like cough, congestion, any of that stuff going on. Um, it's great during nap times and at bedtimes. We get that peace and calm and it helps calm down their respiratory area. All right, Stress Away is up next. And this one does exactly what you would think that it does. Copaiba, lime. Um, what else is in this one? A beautiful blend. You guys are going to love it. Smell it. It's delicious. Oh, vanilla. Vanilla is in this one too. And we love keeping this one in our car. Uh, maybe if you have a daily commute and you sit in traffic, put a roller top on this baby and wrists, neck, all the great things. You can sniff that one in. It's also great in the diffuser to help create a calming environment at home at the end of the day. Um, we love, if you are a mom, if you are a teacher, if you are a walking human, you can benefit from Stress Away. Um, 
I also have several friends who have used oils like this for to help their bodies through a season of anxiety and stress um, and depression. So if any of those are um, plaguing you, then these are good supports to reach for. Um, now our bodies change, they're always changing, so maybe one day you love valor and one month you really connect with peace and calming. Uh, don't be scared to mix it up to get different oils on your body during different seasons. Um, all right, these are our starter kit oils, you guys. So, so many uses, way more than I even touched on today. So the important thing is to get these oils in and on your body. Now, Young Living is not just an oil company. They're a total body wellness company. So once you get comfortable with your oils, definitely explore and dig in and start making those extra switches uh, to make your home chemical-free, toxin-free, and safe for everyone in your family. All right, you guys, enjoy your kit.